In this video, we will walk through how to set up and turn on GigSky mobile data and use your visa benefits on an iOS device. Before we begin, make sure you have everything you need to set up GigSky, an eSIM capable iOS device unlocked and running iOS 12.1 or later. Download the GigSky app from the App Store and make sure you have a strong Wi-Fi connection. After you install the GigSky app on your device, enable notifications for the GigSky app to receive important updates about your data plan. Visa cardholders should tap the Visa banner in the home screen in order to access additional benefits. To check if your Visa card is eligible for a GigSky benefit, enter the card number and tap Check Eligibility. If the card is eligible, you will see a screen like this. If it is not eligible, you can go back to the GigSky home screen to purchase a regular plan. If you do not already have a GigSky account, you will need to tap Create Account and complete the following prompts. To register your card, enter the card details. You are not obliged to use this Visa card to pay for all GigSky services. Other credit cards or Apple Pay may be used to purchase service from GigSky. However, you can only take advantage of the Visa benefit when you use the eligible Visa card as your payment method. In the home screen, you can see the entitlement details of any eligible Visa card that you have added. Tap on Redeem Now, shown in any of your eligible Visa card entries, to see the details of the benefit. Tap on the info icon to see the list of countries included in the plan. To purchase this plan, tap on the blue box and continue to the checkout process. During the installation process, Make a note of the label that iOS gives your new eSIM. You'll need this later to make sure that you can select the GigSky eSIM for use. Select Primary for default line. Choose Primary for iMessage and FaceTime to keep the same cell phone number associated with those services. For cellular data, also called mobile data in some countries, select Primary if you're still at home or choose the label of your new eSIM if you're already at your destination and ready to use GigSky data. Now, configure your device. Go to Settings and tap Cellular or Mobile Data in some countries. Select your new eSIM to access its settings. When you are ready to use the eSIM, enable the Turn on this line option to activate the eSIM if it already isn't turned on. To choose your new eSIM for mobile data usage, follow these commands. Remember, don't turn it on until you're ready to use it. If you're not at your final destination, you can always come back to this video and complete the setup when you're ready. Go to Settings, Cellular, then tap Cellular Data. Scroll down and find the entry for your GigSky eSIM. Tap on it to select your new eSIM. Ensure Allow Cellular Data Switching is turned off to prevent accidental use of your primary carrier's roaming data. Now, turn off mobile data for any apps you don't need it for. Go to Settings, Cellular, or Mobile Data. Scroll down until you see a list of apps with switch toggles next to them. Switch off the apps you don't want to use mobile data. Scroll all the way to the bottom and turn off Wi-Fi Assist, iCloud Drive, and iCloud Backup. You're now ready to use your GigSky mobile data plan. Enjoy seamless connectivity wherever you go. If you have any questions or need any further assistance, feel free to reach out. Thanks for watching.